You know, one of the ideas that a lot of people don't understand about Unity students is that when we pray, we don't bow our heads. We lift our faces straight up in this position. And I don't think that a lot of people know why Unity students do that. Because in the good old days, when you went into the presence of the king, you went in in a prostrate form. You laid down and you bowed your head so much lower than the king. That is everyone except the children of the king. The children of the king did not bow down. They walked into the presence of the king with their heads straight up, with their shoulders back, knowing exactly who they were. And that's why in unity, when we pray, when we go to our Father in the silence of our being, when we speak the word with power, we don't bend our heads this way. We look straight ahead and up and say, I'm the child of a king, the child of a king. With Jesus, my Savior, I'm the child of a king, and I was meant to be prosperous. So think about that when you're praying that you were a child of a king and that you were meant to be prosperous. You have the spiritual right, the spiritual right as the child of a king to peace, peace of mind, harmony and love in all of your relationships, health of body, health of body, health of mind, and plenty in all of your affairs. You have this spiritual right, and we must claim that spiritual right. 